This is Daily. I am a polyamorous vampire fairy witch. <laughs> she fell in love with Logan. Logan and I have been together well over 10 years now. Got married in 2016. They also live with Logan's girlfriend, Elona. His girlfriend is just as important as I am. Both relationships are equal. And today, Daly is celebrating her two year anniversary with her coven of polyamorous witches. Wow. Since finding love in their polycule, Daly has been. <laughs> relationships. When you see a man with multiple partners, you're like, oh yeah, high five, you know? But when a woman is with multiple partners, it's like, oh, she's a I would describe our relationship as a, definitely like a life partnership. We make each other laugh constantly. We tease each other constantly. He loves to tickle me until I throw him off me. He's extremely supportive. I've always been very attracted to her unique energy spectrum that she puts off. Of course we're attracted to it. Oh! Oh, jeez. I oh, need God. some freaky bitches. Oh! Yeah! Yeah! Come get all this blood. Yeah! Okay. Oh, it's so Georgia can't shit, bro. Bro, I was listening to the radio one day, yeah. and this dude just started growing off, and now we would love Doja as a girlfriend. Because he just, just knows she's going to be on some free shit. She's on some different yeah, shit, bro. She's on some different shit. He just shit. knows this bitch is going to be on some freaky shit. Factual. Factual. That was a point off. Love, love Doja as a girlfriend. Who would it? Who would it, bro? Bro? Who would it? I couldn't it? agree more. I couldn't agree more with this I dude. Bro. I was like, thank wow. God. Thank God. God I'm not the only one. Thank God I'm not the only one. <laughs> Who thought having Georgia as a girlfriend would be crazy as shit? Yo. She'd be on some freaky shit, bro. bro. She'd be on some different shit. Bro. Wow. She's on some different she stuff, bro. bro. Wow. Wow. Ah, but anyways, back to the video. Oh, bro. Back to the video. Go <laughs> straight to the video. Go to the video. Does in the same kind of way. Good morning. Good morning. Our relationship was polyamorous from the beginning. His girlfriend is just as important as I am. Now we are married, so like obviously that comes with some responsibility. Yeah. But as far as like relationship, both relationships are equal. She's always been she's always been here. She's never not been here. I think I moved in with you guys like what? It was like It was like six years ago. Yeah. No, but it was like two months into us like actually dating. Oh, for yeah. Sure. Like it was really fast. All three of us used to be together, and then they broke up, and then we broke up, and then we got back together. She's just been here ever since. So today is actually the two year anniversary with me and my three other partners. And it's also the anniversary of our coven forming. So today we're kind of celebrating our anniversary. We're gonna do a little ritual and also go to dinner and just have a, a little coven date. So we are in a polycule and a polycule is essentially just the word for a network of people that are all dating in some way. You ever heard of a polycule, bro? Bro? This shit just keeps getting wilder and wilder. <laughs> A polycule! What the fuck is that? <laughs> Bro, I'm guessing it's multiple poly relationships mm -hmm. coming together <laughs> to become one giant cesspool. <laughs> multiple cool. people dating each other. Bro, dating a fucking. Bro! Cesspool! <laughs> wow! Bro! Oh, God. Crazy! Crazy! All connected through They're all dating. connected through a romantic relationship. Yeah. So in our polycule, we have me and Logan who are married, and then I have my partner Jeffrey, who is a gay man, and then I have my girlfriend Zoe, uh, who is married to my boyfriend Zeph. And then Logan has his girlfriend, Alona, and then Jeffrey also has a boyfriend. Hey, did you get all of that? <laughs> Bro, I'm not, I'm not even gonna run that back. There's no point, I will never get <laughs> What the fuck is she's she dating? She, she's dating him. We're dating hey, together. And it's just leave that. Don't worry about that. Leave that, bro. Don't waste time. The coven is myself, Jeffrey, Zoe, and Zeph. We use the term coven because we do practice magic together. Fuck this. <laughs> We identified that we each represented one of the, the elements mm -hmm. yeah. and we did a ritual together and it was just like the yeah. energy was so palpable and we kind of all just looked at each other and we're like, what happened? After we started doing rituals together, we started forming a romantic partnership. We would get together and you could feel 
like, like energies. the magic and the, the connection and the chemistry. I just found myself falling in love with these people. I call upon a direction of the east, the watchtower of the east, the direction of new beginnings and transformations and change. Join us now. Hail and welcome. Hail, Hail and welcome. welcome. I call upon the watchtower of the south, the element of fire, of passion. All oh, this element talk is giving me last day of it, no vibe, bro. <laughs> bro. Hell yeah, yeah, this is what Amazon fans get up to when they grow up. When they grow up. <laughs> oh, I'm doing the oh. elemental. <laughs> Witchy. <laughs> How poorly I'm. Poorly relationships. Oh, oh, you did not just say that, bro. You did not just say oh, that. Elemental, witchy, poly relationship. <laughs> wow. Vacation brings strength to our circle. Hail and welcome. Hail, Hail and, and welcome. welcome. I call upon the watchtowers of the West. Water, intuition, sacred knowledge, and the ancestors. Hail and welcome. Hail and welcome. I call upon the watchtowers of the North. The guardians. Earth, the roots of old and new, bring strength and life. Hail and welcome. Hail and welcome. We all identify as witches, and basically what that means is we we work with the energies and the elements around us uh, to create alchemy and to create changes in our lives. Roots of old and always binding. Roots of old and always binding. Roots of old and always binding. This planet is very much alive. It's a breathing spirit, and we are in communication with it. when a woman is poly because misogyny you know, misogyny yeah because when you see a man with multiple women or multiple partners they're like oh yeah high five you know but when a woman is with multiple men or or you know multiple partners it's like oh she's a yeah. <laughs> all right let's go eat i always get these who will walk up to me and they'll go hey man i just see that you've got all these chicks man like how do you do that like just like teach me and i'm like well, I'm, I'm polyamorous. It's just one of those things where like, you know, as long as you are being open and everything is consensual between you and your partners, your consenting adults doing whatever you want, that's great. People see, you know, us and they find out that we're poly and they're like, oh my God. I could never do that. But, but then, they, like, they've cheated, cheated on their husband like three times yeah. or their wife or they've divorced and remarried with people they've cheated with. I'm like, bro, facts. Instead of sneaking around and doing all of this cheating, why not just be funny? Facts. <laughs> Why don't just be nah, 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 big facts. Big facts. There's <laughs> some extra bitches in that joint. <laughs> There's some extra bitches in that joint. Extra bitches. There you know it's wow. going on so you can try to cheat on your wife, bro. It's crazy. Facts. Factual. Let's be funny. Shit. Facts. He's making facts. sense. He's making facts. Facts. I'm telling you. Wow. He's making sense. Just, you know, if you want to have sex with other people, if you want other relationships, just say that, admit that, and you'll find someone who's cool with that. Factual! Jesus! Well, and life is so short, and, and life is hard. You find those pockets of joy mm -hmm. and, and love, like, hold on to it. And, like, screw what everybody else thinks, yeah. because... Yeah. Or screw everybody else! Or screw everybody <laughs> else, if that's what freaks you to <laughs> <laughs> All right, I want to make a toast. Here is to two years of my beautiful coven being part of our yeah. polycule. I love you guys so much. Thank you for bringing so much magic into my life. I love okay. you guys. Cheers. Yay. Cheers. She had to say magic. <laughs>
It's crazy. crazy. It's crazy. Crazy. I don't. Th- I don't think I could from it, bro. I don't think I could do that shit. Mm. No, I said there was no other guys involved. Okay. Maybe. Okay. Because even if there's no other guys involved, it's just your bitch. It's still not a normal polyamorous relationship. Okay. There's gonna be other lesbian bitches getting freaky with my lesbian <laughs> bitches. I, I might. I might still get jealous, bro. There's no other guys involved, but I might still get those are my lesbian bitches. Getting freaky bitches with other lesbian bitches without me. Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, nah. Without nah, me. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, I might, I might still get jealous. Nah, I'll be jealous. Nah, I'm not without sure from this, from this political cool without me. Nah, that's that's way out there. That's way out there. Mm. The usual trouble, the trouble yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> this party cool kid. It's a Without different the window, bro. bro. Wow. wow. Without me. <laughs> Do you know what's also funny? Do you know what's also fucking hilarious? Mm. It's crazy. Because the, cra- <laughs> the craziest thing about this video yeah. turned out to be the polycule. Okay. And not the fact that you're all fucking witches. <laughs> bro. The craziest thing. The craziest thing about the video is the body group, not the fact that they're all fucking witches, bro. <laughs> wow. Oh, bro, you're right now there. Bro. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fucking witches, bro. <laughs> fucking witches. On some underworld shit. Yeah, Van Helsing would have a field day. Van Helsing would have a field day. Yeah. Yeah, yeah call Buffy. <laughs> Alright guys, uh, Yo, that's me for love, don't judge. Oh, this bro, week, that's me uh, it. Boy, it's a bit sweaty. Like that. <laughs> Turn up the fucking AC, please. Bro, it's hard as well. Oh, that's me for love, don't judge this week. Wow. That was one of the more crazier episodes. For that. Vamps. 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 Witches. Adreno. Elemental. Probably. Last Airbender vibes. Last Airbender wow. vibes, bro. <laughs> wow. 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 You're killing me today, bro. She was crazy, bro. Oh, oh. Jesus Christ. But anyways, uh, <laughs> I have uh, a couple comments. Mm. Some funny shit from the comment section. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, run it back, run it back, bro. run it back. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Let's yeah, go. Man. I, do, I got some funny shit yeah? from the comment section. Run it back. <laughs> All right, so this is what we're gonna do here. We're gonna run the video here, mm. so you might know they can get the context. Mm. So you all can get the context, mm. and then we're gonna get into the comments. <laughs> Bro, these comments are hilarious. All right. all right, run the video. <laughs> Put the money in 